And it goes a little yeah. something like What's going on guys? It's the Kui here and I'm back with another skate three video. <laughs> so in today's video I'm gonna show you guys <clears throat> how you guys can get the uh, the red hands skater. Um there's two ways to do this. I'm gonna be showing you both of the ways or telling you how to do it, I guess. But uh telling you and showing you. But the red hand skater, if you've ever seen the black if if you've ever seen the black hand skater, the red hand skater is just a more rare and in my opinion a cooler looking version of the black hands. I don't know, it just gives them a more vibrant feel, you know? But the first way you're gonna wanna do this is you want to basically just download the game save that I'm gonna link in the description. Um if you know what you're doing and how to if you know how to download the game save, go ahead and do it and you know how to get it on your console and all that, you're good, just go ahead and do that and come back to this video. But if you don't know what you're doing, um, just look up on YouTube how to do this, because there's tons and tons of videos on how to do this. So, <coughs> and the second way is that next Monday, or this upcoming Monday, whenever I do my next import skater video, the skater I'm going to be doing is a red hand skater. So if you want to do that, if you don't know how, if you don't know or don't want to do the game save, go ahead and import it. But once you've done all that, just go make sure you go into Edit Skater, Edit Skater. Now, once you've got the game server or whatever, just make sure that you're not connected to EA Nation. Because if you connect to EA Nation when you first start up the game, it, it's gonna kill your, it's gonna take away all your graphics. You're not gonna have your graphics, so you're gonna have to go back and get the game or get all the stuff again and all that. You're gonna have to download the game save again and redo everything. <sighs> Sorry, I'm tired. But, uh, so, after you've done that, basically, uh, you wanna take your shirt off once you make sure that you're not connected to the nation. You wanna go into body mods, upper body tattoo. Now, this is where most people mess up, and make sure to pay attention here. You cannot pick anything other than your left arm. If you pick anything other than your left arm, this glitch will not work. If you pick anything other than your left arm, you're probably going to get frustrated that it doesn't work. So, just be careful and keep in mind that the, um, th this only works in your left arm. So, don't try anything else. You're probably not going to get anything. So, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> uh, I can't hit A. That's good. Uh, my game, I think my game just froze. No, it didn't. Alright, we're good. Um, you want to go into, if you, you know you did it right, if you see 1, 2, 3, 4, there's boxes, and then you can see in any of the three categories. But, first you want to pick your red box, which is in this game save, uh, graphic 4. You want to make it as big as possible. Not, not as big as possible, but just put it around your elbow like that, around there. Then you want to go back into merchandise, jackets, and before you select something, there's going to be this little delay before you, your character shows that it's on. So you want to press A right before that, right before that shirt or jacket comes on, so that there are red box on the outside of your shirt. Now, once you've done that, you want to go back into body mods, back to upper body tattoo, and left arm. Yes. Now you want to pick your uh, your red box again. My mom said black box. And you want to make it as big as possible. If you make it as big as possible, it should look like this. And uh, you just want to bring it down while rotating it to the right while using RB. And just know that this glitch does not work on a female skater, I don't think, because it does not have the customizable windbreaker. Correct me if I'm wrong, but it doesn't work on a female. But you just want to make sure that your collar is the same color as the red box, like I saw. Like you see right there. Um, if you don't want to have like this big red box on your arm, you can just make it smaller and move it like back behind your wrist and just make sure that the collar is the same color. So I'm going to hit A, and I'm going to go back into my merchandise. And then what's going to happen then is if I go to my shirt and I remove it, boom, I have red hands. So it's not really that difficult, just I feel like the most difficult part is honestly just the game save. <laughs> um, yeah, so um, if you want to customize the skater, you can go ahead and do it. It doesn't work with all of the shirts, but it works with most. So most likely the shirt you'll want it on has it. So, I'm gonna come back to you guys when I'm done editing my skater. And yeah, I guess also with this game save, you own every all of the Dr. Pepper stuff. So just keep that in mind. And I'll see you guys when I'm back. Alright, um, I'm back guys. And, 
Yeah, um, as you saw, I customized as my, I customized, I can't speak, I have dyslexia, sorry. What? Um, but, you know, if you don't know how to do the, the game save, or you just don't have the stuff that's possible for it, this is the second way, and it's the import skater way. Now, the import skater way, obviously, is you're just going to import my skater, and next week's, or next Monday's video, is going to be another import skater, and that import skater is going to be this red hands one. So, um, also if you're too late to the red hands skater import that I'm going to do, just see if you can get it off a friend or anyone you know who has it, or uh, are going to have to like get the stuff to do the red hands if you actually want it. Um, yeah, like I said, they say if your friend gets the import skater off this video or knows anyone who has it, ask them to import it, then you import off them. That's really the only advice I can give for if you miss out on the import. And, um, all I really want to say here is, uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure to hit the like button, you know, subscribe, turn on post notifications, I guess. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Alright, so, um, I just wanted to add this on as a side note, because I forgot to add it when I was recording the video. Um, if you load up your Skate 3 again, or whatever, and you get back on your game, or it just doesn't want to show your graphics, all you want to do is just go into Edit Skater, and then exit out, and hit Yes to save. Um, once you do this, your skater should go back to normal. If it doesn't, then you probably connect it to EA Nation, or in the middle of editing your skater or whatever. But, I just wanted to say that, because I know some people will probably either get, like, confused or something, and their graphics want to show up, and, you know, I'm just not trying to get flamed, even though I know I probably wouldn't for this. It's just a thing that happens. But, I just wanted to add this to tell you guys that, yeah, make sure to like, subscribe, and, uh, turn on post notifications, because I'm going to be uploading a lot more. I triple upload it today. But uh yeah, make sure to like the video, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and uh, just tell me the type of video you want to see next and I'll see you guys next time. And it goes a little yeah.